Alrighty guys, welcome back to Ark, where today I'm just going to be going around and mostly finishing up the oil farm. And on top of that, we are also going to be finishing the poison wyverns. Uh, and then after that, we are going to start breeding up our wyvern army for tomorrow. Now, it is already pretty late today, so I'm pretty sure what I'm going to have happen is I'm going to get the poison wyverns done then I'm probably gonna hop off so yay I'm just gonna give you guys a heads up there I've been going for a while today I'm tired luckily I did get a day off which is tomorrow which is Friday so yeah I'm gonna be spending most of it trying to get uh, the manticore defeated on alpha that's hopefully what I do and then hopefully I got time to go in and go and finish my uh, my Gears of War 2 playthrough. Sorry, I am tired, guys. I'm, as you can tell, I'm, my mind is, yeah, my mind is asleep. So I'm gonna, I gotta hatch these last three jug bug eggs for the farm. I already got the other three over here. They're already all grown. They just got done here. Maybe I, I'm not joking. When we were up there, like when I first started a minute and a half ago, they still had the red imprinting on them. So they just, ha they just got done. So I gotta wait for these now. Okay, there they are. That's our jug bugs. That's the three. So as you can see there, I got pretty nice colors on my oil jug bugs here for Scorched Earth. I'll show you their exact stats here in a second once I get this last one claimed. Boom. So once we got our jug bug bugs bred together, we managed to get the 45 stamina, which is their recharge. That's how fast they uh, generate stuff. And then on oxygen, that's their capacity, we got the 37. <laughs> I really wish that 46 that's in their health was in there, but that's not what we got. We got this. And it's still pretty good, although technically my water jug bugs did turn out better than my... Uh... Actually, not by much, not by much. They have two more points. I wish, I wish, and I'll... I might try it on Aberration. Um for their capacity because also here's the thing the reason I'm not worried about these guys for farming is because most of the time you level them up anyways um, and that's where you get a lot of that from is from the levels especially with my settings and then yeah and then uh, yeah, as I was saying when aberration comes out and then we get the aberrant variants of them and the element jug bugs of course I'll make the farms for them and hopefully we're able to get better oxygen and hopefully even a better stamina I'd like to try and get 50 on each so you guys can stay here let's go grab that other uh, I'm pretty sure my wyverns have produced another wyvern egg by now we'll pop it down you know what you can eat that one I'll let you you two you're done so I'm gonna take your oil and then I'll cryo potty you just so that way you guys don't have anything you know although I might next time just wait until they're full but yeah that's our two jug bugs nice and as you can see I do got my wyverns on me I might start those now that we do got the jug bugs all done uh, we you know we just throw down my last two. you know what let's do that right now before I even hatch these eggs alright so let's quickly here all I need on my hotbar right now for breeding is this stuff actually I just need my melee tool and I need my binoculars so that way I can see uh, their stats. So, boom. Let's do this. So, I gotta make sure as well that the female is closest to the Overraptor just so that way my eggs aren't, you know, going every which way. Or, you know, just ain't left out in the open. So, that's the Fire Wyvern. Ooh, come on. That's the other fire wyvern I need. I don't even need to move you, my man. We'll just hop over. Enable mating on both of them. Boom. Mating is enabled. And then over here, we'll throw out the lightning wyverns. I hit. I just realized I hit seven in there. There's nothing in there. Come on, you can fit. There you go. Okay, okay. Which one is... You're the male. You are the female. I know this is going to start looking pretty crowded here, and I'm sorry about that. It's the best I can do. Um, especially with the space that I have currently set up right now for breeding on Scorched Earth. 
But hopefully after next episode, we are... I'm not going to do too many episodes on Scorched Earth, but I'm going to do a couple more where we're actually on the island and we're going to be staying more on the island. Um, Because there's a bunch of creatures on the island I didn't tame here in ASA yet. Now, I've tamed them all in Ark Survival Evolved. Alright? I have a... Also, if you guys ever get bored of my ASA content, remember, I have 150 episodes of Ark Survival Evolved. Which, I will say that there are some ones that are pretty poor quality. And you know what? I will say this about my last last couple episodes here. There have been ones that have, are of poor quality and I really wish I hadn't uploaded. Especially in the shorts formats. I really feel like I've kind of uh, given up on shorts for some reason. And I, I do realize something here as well as that. Shorts are, have helped my channel out a lot, and I think I just need to back off on how many I'm doing and focus more in on the quality, or I keep on doing the amount I'm doing, and I just kind of find better things to, like, clip and do the shorts of, and also, when I do that, get a proper title for it, more describe what I'm doing in the video instead of, you know, just some random, yeah, you know, that's what I need to do. Also, sorry, like, I'm running around in circles as I talk. It's just, I can't stand still and talk, because then it feel like I, like, in my editing, I feel, it feels like it looks weird, you know? But I also realize when I move around and do that, like, that causes some issue for some people. Okay, these eggs are almost done. I should probably eat something here, so that way I don't do that. Also, this is <laughs> really tiring. What the hell's going on? Oh, yes, that's why they're still poison wyverns. That's why their stats aren't balanced. I really just got confused. I confused myself there for a whole second. I'm not going to lie. You there, the 120, the 220, you're good. 214, no. Okay, so I only got one out of this batch. That's good. I full on got ready to claim them all because I thought I was doing dino or my dino army. Damn it! I can't get it because they're all piled. If I get him to move, maybe. There we go. Now we can do this. That's how you get rid of any X's, Y, ones you need. And that's also how I get food for my uh, Phoenix. So. I'm going to kind of just sit back here, and well, I'm going to hatch, of course, me these eggs, because that's going to be... I have to get six of each, so i got to keep track how many I have, how many I have hatched, and how many more I need. So, that should be two of each, so I need four more of the lightning and fire. So, luckily, we got wyverns that came out fine, no problems. Unfortunately, I, I also I realized I just like full on like eh, that was my hand. That's like not actual drift. That was my hand. Uh, but I'm a little upset we didn't get like triplets or twins out of any of them. Also, I'm missing one. Where is it? When do you guys go on a journey? No, there was four of them there. What the hell? Yep, yep, he went in a journey, alright. One hell of a journey. Okay, you can go chill there with them. So, I need two, I need four more lightning and four more fire. Six poison, but the poison aren't done yet. I will say this, I do feel like now that I have started recording and talking, it's helping me wake up a slight bit more. But when I, you know, there's still that good uh, times where I'm just sitting here and I don't know what to do. And I'm just staring at the eggs like, I'm going to fall asleep, you know? Okay, so my first couple wyverns here are almost ready for their imprints. I grab my wyvern milk. Once cuddle, once milk. What is this lightning wyvern want back here? There we go, and then you want cuddle. Thank you. 
Only one of them wanted milk, luckily. My second batch of uh, poison wyverns here should be done here as well. I'm just going to sit here and let you guys see what I have to watch. So there's three eggs there. Is there any one of them that has the stats I want? <clears throat> No, they're all scrap. <clears throat> this is my... This is going to be my day. Just no poison wyverns that I need. So, as well, <clears throat> I just grabbed the last couple eggs I would need for my uh, fire and lightning wyverns. So, I'm going to kind of make piles here. One, two, three. Wait, hold up. No, I don't. No, I don't. Because I only got two of each. I'm missing one egg. And I even just went through and disabled all their mating. My mind is dying on me. I'm so tired. I should probably go to bed, but I need this video. <coughs> you know what? No, I'm going to keep on recording. But it's already too late for this video to come out on schedule. It's no longer Thursday. As of right now, it's 12 o'clock midnight. Sorry guys, there was no videos yesterday. I guess today is, uh, you're going to get two videos because I'm going to, once I wake up again, I'm going to just focus on getting Manticore done and by that, what, you know what, I just need to keep my wyverns breeding because I'm going to need a lot of eggs, especially if I'm going to level up my guys. I get legit killing them with that and then I'll go get Explorer notes as well, run around and pick them up if I can on the wyverns, but yeah. I can't believe I just forgot that I needed one more egg. Damn, I actually need another lightning wyvern egg as well. So I only had two. Okay. <clears throat> now, I have all the eggs I need for my wyverns. <clears throat> so, I'll throw a pile down here for the fire wyvern. And then right over here next to it, we'll throw down a lightning wyvern egg pile. And now, hopefully, I'm going to break that rock in between them here real quick. But hopefully, uh, we get some good ones. Hopefully, we even get some ones with mutations that are good. You know, I know I really don't do mutation stacking at all just because of the settings I have on my server. Um, but I might actually want to look into that because, as you guys who have seen my ASA series know, Due to me playing with, firstly, single player settings turned off on ASE, that made Rockwell on, well, it made the Master Controller and Rockwell Prime basically nearly impossible for me to do solo. And then on top of that, my computer was laggy back then, because again, I was on my old computer playing it, which again, that was not the best for Arc. And, uh... Well, sometimes, like, again, during, like, Rockwell Prime, when I would transition from the me the mech to run around and stuff or to get back on my mount, um, like, the game would, like, stutter or whenever new creatures would spawn in. And then, of course, all my shadow mains, like, they're, they're ripping everything apart, but, like, they can only do so much. And I have to, of course, run around on my mount and target the, you know, the... What the hell's going on? Damn it, Terror Bird. There was a damn Terror Bird in my base. You guys are all fine. Just irritating that that was happening. I also should probably hear, uh, let's go grab the Jug Bugs and let's kind of try and throw them in spots. What is it? I'm here. That got to just stop running. How close to death were you? You're half health. I don't like that. It got my it got my morale tops all the way down to half health. 
That's not good. I honestly should probably set up some plant species X on this map. And all that. That'd probably be the best idea right now. But I don't have any of the seeds. That means I have to go back to the island. And I know I did say, I like, hey, I'm going to throw that rule out. I, just because I've broken it so much. Alright, guys, that's why I'm throwing the rule out. I've broken it too much already. So it's kind of become pointless. Like, you know. Uh, I do understand that it did upset people because I even said, like, hey, I'm no longer going to go back to the island. Then I took a break and then I came back and I like, hey, I'm back on the island for some reason. Yeah, that, that was uh, that was great. But I'm thinking when we go to Aberration, I'm absolutely going to make it so that way I can't go back to the island at all. And if I do, I already said this. I will have to toss a creature out of the genetic library. And it won't be one I get a pick. I No, 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 no. I am going to be setting up a spin wheel. So that way it's random. <clears throat> and that doesn't mean like I'm going to actually go back to the island. That is just a punishment. So that way if I do and I'm willing to like give it up at some point. Like I will. But I highly doubt I will just because of how drastic of a punishment I've made it. Where I quite literally lose a creature I worked hard on getting put into that library, you know? Also, I don't think I can get this guy in there all the way with the way I have it set up. No, I cannot. So, that means... Come on. Also, I should go probably check on the eggs. Just realize, they probably have all hatched already. No, they're not. How close? They still got a minute. I do got enough time to quickly show you how I'm going to do this now over here. So for the jug bug farms, the way we're going to do it now is... Uh, originally, I had them double deckers back in uh, Genesis. Not Genesis. Extinction. I didn't have farms set up on Genesis because uh, I came over with only the goal of taming the exclusive creatures. And then trying to fight the boss with them. That might have also been the reason why I couldn't beat the master controller is because I went about it that way um I think I need one just so that way I have a, a male over here in the pile my phone rang <laughs> felt it too I have my buzzer on now for my phone or is it the buzz because at night I've been like almost sleeping through the ringtone and for some reason the buzzer has been helping but yeah, that's the that's the oil farm. Um, you know, I, I might no, eh, maybe if I could get, I don't know what I would do there, honestly, because the railings are no longer the same height, and I don't need you anymore. So um, you're almost done. You're the one that still needs to go for a walk, aren't you? Oh, you just want to cuddle now. Okay, that's perfect. Oh wait, no, you all do. I forgot they still actually had one left. Um, um. No, you're the one that wants to go on a walk. So this is the one that's going to be 75. Actually, you're going to be the one that's stuck at 50 because I can't do anything. Okay. Now, there we go. These guys are all at, should be at 100. Okay. These are done. Boom. I feel like I got... One egg here that I'm waiting on. Yep. Then, ooh! Ooh, look at that one in the middle. We got a mutation. Okay, hold up. I already got a name for it. I might... Oh. Do I hang on to that one just because? Okay, like, I want you to understand. Where's your mutation at? It's a weight mutation, damn it. I don't know. We might keep him. You know what? You know what I'm gonna do is because uh, I don't want to take Thor or Azula into the boss fight because I won't get them back at the end. He will be my mount. All right, I'll ride a fire wyvern. No, or do I? Yeah, no, I'll ride the fire wyvern. Why not? Also, I have to glue some clean up. There's no getting around these guys. So, uh, how close are these? Oh, they're not even incubating. Damn. 
I should have checked that before I wandered off. So you guys are going. I need to get me some more cryopods for that. I need to finish off my poison wyverns. I need to throw you guys back in the collection. And so, yeah. Anyways, this is a really bad lighting. Damn. Uh, so anyways, if you guys have found yourself at any point liking this episode, please do remember to leave a like and subscribe. Also remember to ring that notification bell so that way you guys get notified upon me posting videos. And as well, if you guys want to go above and beyond being a subscriber, I am currently running a YouTube channel membership goal. We're trying to get 10 YouTube channel members. It's $1.99. Once we hit that goal, we will be opening up... Uh, server for everyone to play on so yeah anyways it's been gunshot more i signing off i'm gonna go to bed